Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com and today we're going to show you how to connect to a Wi-Fi or hotspot with your Android device. Okay, so when you bought your Android device, uh, you didn't want to get in a data plan because it was just too expensive and you didn't think you'd need internet all the time. People kept telling you you could get a Wi-Fi hotspot uh, and get internet for free. So you went with that. Now, the problem is you don't know what a Wi-Fi hotspot even is, let alone how to connect to one. So let's help with that. First off, a Wi-Fi hotspot, uh, sometimes just called a hotspot or a Wi-Fi zone, is any area where there is a wireless internet signal. This is something that you can connect to with your phone in order to get access to the internet. Now, a lot of times these are free. There are some times where they're, where they're password protected and they cost money say sometimes at the airport stuff like that but most of the time and it's becoming more and more popular they're free um, where can you find them you can find them at places where people congregate during the day um, to either drink or eat or just kind of hang out so there are some parks in the cities uh, major metropolitan cities there's also Starbucks uh, Barnes and Noble cafes those kind of places uh, and chances are the Wi-Fi hotspot there is free so if you want a more detailed explanation of what Wi-Fi is um, and what a hotspot is, you can read right underneath this video. It'll explain it a little bit better. We're gonna assume you kinda know what it is uh, enough for us to continue, and uh, we're gonna show you how to actually connect to a Wi-Fi hotspot. Okay, so on your Android device, you're going to go to the home page like we are here, and you're gonna hit the menu button. It's the one with the lines on it. Hit settings. And you'll see the very first option is wireless and networks or it'll be something similar. So we're going to click on that and you'll see Wi-Fi right there. First thing you need to do to connect to a Wi-Fi area, uh, besides actually being in a Wi-Fi zone, is you need to turn on the Wi-Fi. That'll take a second to turn on. Once that does, you can go to Wi-Fi settings and it's going to show you a list of all of the networks nearby. Anyone that has a lock on it means it requires a password. Ones without locks uh, means they don't. Okay, now mine automatically connected to the first one even though it has a password because I've put the password in before. Uh, once you add a password in here, it'll store it. You'll never have to add it again for that specific network. So if you didn't have the password though, for example, we're gonna do this. It would just sit here like this and not connect to anything. So you're gonna choose which one of these you wanna to connect to. Now I am in an apartment, so I know that this is the Wi-Fi network here in this apartment. Uh, if you're at a Starbucks or whatever, you can either ask the Starbucks personnel or whoever to tell you what the name of the network is, um, or sometimes it's things like AT&T Wi-Fi, et cetera, like that. So we're gonna to connect to this one, so you just tap on it, and then you're going to put in your password. So if you tap in that box, it'll bring up the keyboard. Put in your password for that, All right, and then once you put in the password, you click connect. It'll say obtaining IP address. And eventually it'll say connected. And you'll see that little symbol, the kind of cone thing up at the top, means you're connected. You can now go hit home, go to the browser. Okay, and then it connects to Google and you're all set. Thank you.